Alright, hello everyone and welcome to Doctor Who, The Edge of Time. I don't know how long this game is and it just came out. Let us begin. It's been a while since I've been in VR. I'm in a laundromat. Pull out my cable here. Oof. Soap. Powder. Change. My hands. Okay, so we got the uh, teleportation movement. Do I need to, to make my laundry? Are you? Huh. You talking to me? Strange. Power magazine. That cat. Oh, I can actually put these away? Oh, look at that. Oh, it's crooked. There we go. Alright, I just want to double check one thing, make sure everything's working. Yes, yes, and sound levels look okay. I'm going to turn it down just a little bit. There we go. Alright. Okay. Phone. Hello? Oh, that's right. They did make the doctor a girl. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah, my eyes! It's so bright! Uh-oh. What is that? I threw all my soap in that one. Turn it now? Uh, alright. I see. Sharp. Looks like there's only one exit through the back door in the manager's office. Be careful, and whatever you do, don't. No, not the cliche, whatever you do. Ah, oh, man, the door's unlocked, though. Please use the litter bin and keep this laundry. Please, please. It's so dark. <laughs> Can I turn this on?
Hey! Oh, the lightning in here sucks. Hello, hello, and welcome to the stream, guys. I can't see you. It doesn't work. Okay, what's the code? Oh, great. I gotta search for a code. It's so dark. see any numbers there or on the back okay what about in here nothing oh geez must select stuff no numbers distorting in space and time <laughs> Ball out. Fan. Were there any other photos? Back by the washers? Oh, really? Back by the washing machines? Magazines? Is there a photo over here? Oh, it's not covered with goop? Oh, they're getting angry. Soda powder. Let me switch on the lights. I can see it turn a little. I'm trying to rotate it. In the laundry room. But it's all covered with goo. Alright, let's. Well, there's these things. Nothing there, okay. Back by the washing machines. If it wasn't so dark, maybe I could see. Something on the floor. <laughs> uh, is it this painting? Because I can't see this painting. It's too dark. Back by the washing machines. Do I have a flashlight? No. I got the movement that makes me sick. <laughs> uh, let's look at chat. Physically looking at chat. Uh, no hints there. Okay. Back by the washers. Wait, are those? Yeah, those are the washers. These are dryers. I just can't see anything. I feel like it's here. Oof! I hit the wall right there. <laughs> Jeez. That cat, it's just a magazine. It's got to be here on the ground. Unknown threat. Okay. 
quiet, you. I'll release you. Oh. Oh. 83. 83 and... And... 14. All right. Let's see. Oh, it typed it for me. This looks like a finger. All right, let's see. Make your sonic screwdriver to your waist and press the trigger button. Oh, there we go. That's awesome. Oh, oh gosh. Hold this old radio out on the workbench? Oh. Satellite dish and a battery. What do you say about the car? The car bonnet. I'm trying to reach for it, it just pushes it away though. This definitely clicks. I'm trying to pull the tr Ah! What was that? Oh, I'm on that side of the room? Alright. Ah, stop moving away from me. Alright, let's find the satellite dish. Can't go that way too far. Oh, that's the edge. It is. Where? There it is. Oh, should I sonic the... the Okay. Okay. I forgot the Sonic would do that. Yes. Come on. There you go. The power solves. That magic's it all together. That's it. 
Oh, we called the TARDIS. Uh. Um. But it didn't. It didn't come. You guys can leave. Okay, boosting. Come on, I need to get through. Just gotta use the crawl feature to get in. I guess that's the end of chapter one. Oh, the fuzzies again. Wow. A uh, Jody. Whoa. <laughs> Reminds me of the ending of that one VR game. Very dizzying. Let's turn around so my cables are. Ah! All right, so we gotta dodge these things. Be like one of those connect games. Woo! Losing balance. The Edge of Time, written by Gavin. Ooh, fuzzies again. So it was like an episode. Uh, I guess an uh, episode of uh, the beginning of uh, t t Doctor Who itself. All right, we're in the TARDIS. Okay, I'm here. But where is here? I thought you said you were gonna guide me. Oh no! Oh, here. Okay. 
One, two, three. One, two, three. We need to find out where and when the first time crystal is. This should help locate it. Time crystal. I'm looking for a time crystal. Okay, this one? This one, this one. Uh, not quite. Oh, is there another here? This one, this one, this one, this one, okay. Was it this one? Oh gosh. Okay, this one, this one, this one, that one. Oh, was there another? <laughs> I, I couldn't remember. This one, this one, this one, that one. What? All right, all right, all right. That one. That one. That one. That one. Why did? It hey, was it this? Dang it! Oh, no, it was this one. Ah! All right, let's try again. That one. That. 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 Okay. But what's the next one? Was that it? What did you do that for? Well, there's another one I'm not seeing here. It's that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. Okay. I was looking too closely. It's like a hand. Kind of weird. I'm impressed. We've landed on Lucia Minor. Once you step outside the TARDIS, I won't be able to communicate with you. At least not this time. The local auto defenses won't allow it. I have a feeling you won't be on your own for long, though. But you've got to get a shift on you. With the reality virus, Okay, I'm trying to find my hand here. Oh, <laughs> I didn't need to open the door. Of course not. Oh, what a beautiful day. Yeah, it's quite beautiful. Indeed, butterflies and trees and on a path and fog. Ooh, technology. It's a light.
Uh, it's stuck on my hand. Do I need first aid? No. Alright. Well, I guess we'll just keep moving. Oh, glitch is happening. Ah! Of course, it's got to be dark again. Asmas. Flashlight. Oh, health. Oh, great. Okay, I can't take it with me. Um, so it's turned into a horror game. So I got my health. Okay, so that just went back the way that it came. Well, how do they know that I'm here? Did you tell them? Explosives? I'm guessing that was a light at one point. This is lit. Supplies. More first aid. I don't even know what that is. Oh man. <laughs> Okay, let's keep going. Got my health, got my flashlight, we're fine, we're fine. Do I go? I, I do not follow the deadly creature into his home. Getting all wrapped around the cables. Ah. Oh. Oh, I guess we do have to follow him. Because this, that's where that thing rolled down. It's just, oh, I dropped the health. Ah. Hopefully we find more. I'm following him into the cave. Oh, come on. You can do better than that. You didn't tell me anything. Looks like that grid says that I need uh, a red up there. What's with the lighting? Like yes. Yes, they do look like they can be moved. So it says, tell, tells me green to the left. Red, I'm going to put up there. Blue is bottom right corner. Now, the what a So red top left. Ooh, no, that's not right. 
forest. Triangle, triangle. Those two go together. Gosh, you can hear my headset kind of squeaking as I look around here. It's getting a little old. It's original. So do I have another triangle of that? I do. So to make that one work, I need green on one, two, three, four. Fourth one down. I need a triangle, which is red. Second row, fourth down. I need circle, top left. Circle. Blue. Blue. Well, that doesn't work. I'm following the same one. I was sure the plugs are in the right positions. Red, red. Oh. The plugs need to be placed in the right sockets. The right. Flip the switch and activate the lift. Red's in two spots. Blues in one. Triangles in one. Okay, so this has got a symbol for the triangle. Maybe the triangle's what I gotta do. Red and top left. That looks like blue's in two spots. Blue, second row, fourth one. Then blue is bottom right. Greens in two locations. Green is bottom second one. And then up to right one. Red is the only one. Red's the only one that's got issues. Because Red has only one marker there. Now if we look at that one up there, red would be this row down one, two, three. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Oh. Why has that one got a sun image in it? Let's go exploring some more. Maybe the rest of the answers aren't even here. Looks like a handle. It twisted. This control was here before. Those engineers must have hidden it for a reason. Well done, mate. Okay. You're a step closer to rescuing me. Did I'm I... using your hands on that time system. Oh, jeez. So the other room wasn't even necessary? What?
so bright. Sparklies. Huh, that's weird. My flashlight's gone. Going down. Welcome to the SS Lucia Minor, the largest starship in head space, with over two thousand environments realized for your enjoyment. This flight is now sponsored by the friendly assassins of Pulgarius Five. If someone you know is mildly irritated. So the caves were fake. Of course they were. Do, 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 do. Uh oh, out of gravity. Why are you giving me so much health, game? Look. Om nom 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 nom. Can't go any further. It's probably important. Broken? Might be someone in there. Right there. I can't get through that door. Hello? Hello? Sonic screwdriver, negative. Negative. All right, the one door open. This ship uses a fiber optic laser interface. State of the art stuff. I help to install it. So if you want to take control of this ship and set me free, you're going to have to get busy with some lasers. Really? That's how you power your doors? Lasers that become moved? Okay, so we need to tilt this to a controller in the other room. Well, it's splitting off into two, but uh, I don't see anything else it's interfacing with. So, I suppose we'll just send one beam out that way. It tilts a little funny. See, so it realigns that way. Or that way. Hmm. Alright. 
right. Oh, they're actually set up. I need two of them. There we go. It has to be placed on holders. This can turn. Ah, this one open now. Oh boy, this joysticks. So, what's the goal? Just to get out. Are we hitting this way? No, we need it shooting out that way. Okay, to get that, we need that there. We need this one. Outer rings in place. Outer rings out of place. Outer rings in place. Just walk it. Okay. We just need the inner ring, which moves with that one. Very close to that one being right. So they're both lined up on that side now. Now, if only I could rotate the outer two rings in the same direction. All right, so that's lined up. We just need it to be straight. Outer ring. This one does outer ring in middle. This one does all three. This one does outer ring and middle ring. One, two, three. One, two, three. Huh. That should have worked. Can I break it? No. One, two. One, two, three. Oh, because the outer one takes longer to get around. See. OK, 
Okay, we've reversed it now. We went from there to there. Close. This one needs to move. But it, it takes longer to move it. So... We can either do the outside ring or the inside ring. One, two, three. Okay, that's in the right spot. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, one, two. It's there again. Ah! <laughs> okay, we're here again. Okay, now the middle's out of alignment. think we got it. We're hitting the outside edge now. Ah! So that was not the answer. Where do we need to send the laser then? Was it at me? Reflective surfaces. I don't see any. I'm sure we had the answer there. I was going to figure it was going to head out here and hit that thing, splitting it to those two, like how that one's being hit and splitting it off to those two. I do have another door. These two need to be hit, I'm guessing. And it needs to hit them in a way. Hmm. Maybe if we switch. Ah. This one with this one. Actually, it needs to go here. And then we need to send the laser back that way. It's just sending it back at itself. And I can't adjust this, right? No. Hmm. That door only needs one hit. The only thing that needs two is those things. 
What if we... And then in here we had a laser. Which we could adjust into splitting into two. Or could we use this one to reflect it? And split in, instead of being two, it'd be one. There we go. So we put it there. Yeah. Okay. We take this guy. I can't take this one out because the door closes. I need another. Okay, now I just need the middle. Okay, through two, and we just need the door to be on the opposite side. Okay, they're facing me, hitting this joystick, but not what we need. Now, it is straight ahead. We've got it! I don't know why it didn't work last time, but we've got it now. Okay, we've got multiple, multiple laser beams. We're gonna go grab this one real quick. Grab you. Uh, grab you. And you're gonna split the beam here. I'll have to, oh. It's so quick to close. Dang. So I still need this one then. That just hits the floor. This thing doesn't turn. I need one more right there, which is in there. Or there. It's in there. So if I move that, I lose two lasers. Access to that one. Because the door needs power. We've got that room secured. What am, what's down here? Any lasers down here? No. Just one of those creatures. Huh. 
Well, I could adjust this mount, you know? That's a solid. Unless... No, that won't work. Laser splitting. And I lose the laser if I take this out. It has to go there. That one can be added, but all it does is send a laser pulse this way, which requires a splitter to split it. The moment I remove that one, the door closes. We've got that puzzle room solved in here. Good thing these are not deadly lasers. Ah, my phone! I just... I don't know. Maybe we'll, we'll look at chat and see... Well, I know that. Let's see, how's chat doing? Suppose chat's doing alright. Let's see... Oh, I see, I see. That's the problem. Okay. Of course. And the question is, how? How do I get additional lasers? If I can't move that one. That one's primary. Keeps the door open. Because if I switch it... Let's try that one more time. Phew! Excuse me. Oh, okay. So that one just can't go there. Oh my gosh, I can set that there? That works? Why does that work? So it has to be in this air. Ah. Just something has to be in that slot, huh? Excuse me. Oh, let's see here. I want to get off my hand now. Well, we got multiple lasers. <laughs> the refraction is a bit of an issue. The one door we need to keep open is this one. So this was sticking here a minute ago. Y'all saw it. It was working. Uh, maybe 
maybe it was just a glitch. That just reflects it back at itself if put there. So that one has to be there. Has to. This thing cannot be moved. Okay. Okay. This laser could be sent out there. But the moment that I need this door active. Just flies back into place. <sighs> I've got that puzzle done. I just need another device. Because mm. that needs both doors active. Our sensors. There's not another one just sitting on the floor in here, is there? No. No. Let's look at chat. Maybe chat has an answer for us now. Chat says, unable to communicate with chat. <laughs> uh, okay, let's refresh that chat. All right, chat is active. Huh. No. No one's got a clue. That's keeping both those doors open. Some kind of weird wobbly thing there. Laser goes in, splits twice. There's a laser over here. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, if only I could adjust this. So if I could keep that door active with its own laser beam, That doesn't help. <laughs> I 
and this has to come this way. Maybe it's a speed thing. <sighs> maybe, maybe, maybe we take this, right? And we aim it at this guy right here. Let's do this. We aim it like that. Then we can take this one out. So why doesn't this one count? doesn't even go there anymore, huh? It's like, I'm happy with this one over here. There we go. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe they weren't expecting the normal person to be able to play that. Uh, it was the big first big puzzle to really uh, really mess with our brains here. Oh, I'm over here now. Uh, let's look at chat. One last chance. Okay, nothing. All right, guys. Well, we may revisit this in the future, but I'm getting tired. Yeah. The, yeah. All right. Well, if you guys have an answer for this question, how? I don't even know where one of those things went. Where'd the other thing go? Uh oh. Well, this is in my hand? It's not in my hands. Well, maybe we're just bugged. All right. Well, this is Billy on the Good Jab C channel. Thanking you all for watching, liking, and subscribing. And I'll see you guys in the next game. Hopefully, it's not as stuck as we are now. <laughs> Alright, see ya. Bye!